Alright, how's it going everyone? My name is Mr. Boss for the win. I hope you guys had a really good Martin Luther King weekend. If you're taking off uh, this day from work or you have it off from your school or university, you know, uh, just try, try to spend that time with your friends or family or, uh, you know, hey, if you enjoy watching YouTube videos, do that as well. But anyways, uh, just a quick note about the gameplay. Um, I actually don't know if I've used this before. I got it mixed up in my category if I sent it uh, on a video to Machinima Respawn or, you know, if it was one of the videos that I didn't use or thought I was going to use. So anyways, I apologize if this is a game you've already seen before, but the information in this video isn't going to be t necessarily based around the gameplay. Uh, it's just a really good game I had on Domination Raids. So anyways, enjoy that if you haven't seen it. If you have, I'm sorry. Open up another tab and, uh, well, you know, I'll get on to what I want to talk about. Anyways, so like I said, what I want to talk about today is Xbox Live to adapt communications over Skype and then payments over the uh, over PayPal. So if you don't know, uh, Microsoft uses, on their Xbox 360, they use what is known as Xbox Live Party Chat, which is essentially a maximum of eight people getting together, and they can talk via mic with their microphones, and they don't have to be in the same game. So one person can be playing Halo 3, the other one can be playing Black Ops 2, and they'll still be able to communicate with each other, which is nice because, you know, sometimes you want to talk to your friends about casual things and not necessarily be focused or be playing on the same game. So I think that's a nice feature. And if you didn't know, Microsoft takes payments through their form of online currency known as Microsoft Points. Now, I think it's like 800 Microsoft Points is $10. And honestly, it's it's kind of a pain to go buy something from Microsoft because you have to stop what you're doing. You have to buy Microsoft Points. You know, it asks you to refresh your information about every six months or every year, or every time you change a credit card number or anything along those lines. You know, it's really frustrating because you have to buy Microsoft Points, you know. Uh, the process is not enjoyable in my opinion. Anyways, so it says, according to CVG, Microsoft will be consolidating all their communications technology around the Skype platform. This means the next generation Xbox as well as PCs and tablets will also see voice and video messages through the next generation Xbox Live via Skype. So that is awesome, you know. Uh, the first thing I think of right there when I think about that is that they're going to be integrating video chat into Xbox Live. Now, depending on how the new Xbox uh, is built, whether they build it with Connect built in or whether it ships with you, you know, video chat might be a very popular thing when it comes to gaming. So that's another thing that you could look at right there. Uh, the next thing that, that is really nice as well. So Skype is awesome. If you don't have Skype, Skype is essentially a video and voice chat program and you know it's got really good features. It allows you to be in a call all at once and the calls are really crisp and smooth. Uh, you know th there's rarely any dropping plus you know there's some people that I have on my Skype account that don't have an Xbox and you know I've done work with them or I play with them in an open lobby and they say Mr. Boss the Win you know I would love to be in an open lobby with you but I don't have an Xbox. Well you know what you can do you can hop on uh, you can hop on Skype and, you know, you can talk to us. You might not be able to play it, but you can definitely talk to us, you know, while we're gaming, which I think is, you know, another good feature right there. So, uh, you know, Skype is all around a good thing. Uh, they also noted that, you know, it was a, they needed that Xbox needed like a designer for the next generation Xbox. So that means that they are working on, uh, you know, they are working on this process of moving everything over to Skype. Uh, which I think will take a little bit of time, but I also think is nice. Getting on with the next segment, so they are moving their Microsoft uh, currency to PayPal. So currently, I have my Xbox 360 linked up to PayPal, so whenever I want to buy Microsoft points, I have to just take money out of my PayPal account. And honestly, it makes the most sense just to have it linked to your PayPal account because, um, you know... Like I said, there's no point of having a Microsoft currency when it's just as easy to take something out of your bank account. That's one of the things that I think the PlayStation Network does really well. Uh, you know, they just use straight money instead of this uh, made-up currency that doesn't exist in this fictitious world uh, known as Microsoft. And so, uh, you know, that's just something that I'm really looking forward to. And uh, I hope that these, uh, you know, these new things come to really come true because this was announced back in November that Microsoft would dissolve uh, the old messaging system because not only is it old and clunky you know I, I think it freezes my Xbox like when I join a party or when I leave a party you know it's frozen for a second and uh, you know that would be uh, that would be tough to do so uh, the buyout of Skype would cost about 8.5 billion dollars so Skype is a very popular company it is a huge brand so Microsoft's gonna have to lay out a lot of chips uh, to have you know 
you know, Skype, hop on board with Microsoft. But anyways, guys, like I said, thanks for watching the video. Thanks for making your Martin Luther King Jr. Day part of, uh, you know, the Mr. Boss of the Wind channel. I really appreciate all you guys coming over from my Machine Marie Respawn video as well. You know, I appreciate it when you guys stop by. Other than that, like I said, like the video, subscribe if you're new. Have a nice day, and I will talk to you in the next video.